Even when it don't feel right I still wanna party with her Even when it don't feel right You know I'ma party with her With her, with her She be calling on a Monday, wanna meet on Tuesday Asking me to fix me up real nice She can wait until the weekend, she wants off the deep end Telling me to bring the stuff I like I don't wanna let it down, so I'm telling her yes Though I'm counting down from the pain in my chest But I'm putting her to sign on, I'm gonna feel her right now Happy from the stuff I know she likes I've been trying my luck Every day of the weekend, yeah. with my baby words up. Hey. Always down every weekend. Yeah. No, I love it too much, but I just can't get enough. She's slipping through the cracks, come up blood. She know what's up. Uh, can't get enough. Yeah, even when it don't feel right. Hey. I still wanna party with her. Oh, yeah. Even when it don't feel right. Hey, you know I'm a party with her, with her, with her. We've been chilling on the Wednesday, slept until it's Thursday. She what's up, what's up, you guys? Y'all already know what time it is. This is an Amazon Prime wig, you guys. Amazon Prime, get your shit on time, girl. So first of all, it's $127.99. $127.99, you guys. I did bleach this unit just to see if the knots would lift just a little bit, and it actually worked. Now what I'm doing, I'm going to hot press it. I use some wax stick on it. I'm going to train the part. Baby, I'm going to do it like it's my B-Day in this Amazon wig. You heard? $127. 150% density, 18 inches. You can't get no better than that. Unice has some really nice wigs. I've actually worked with them um, two handful probably amount of times. I've worked with them enough amount of times. But if you are on a budget, girl, definitely check them out. Of course, you're going to have to customize the wig because it is only $127. But, boo, if you got skills to the moon and back and you can customize, get you this wig, all right? 13 by 4 glueless human hair lace frontal kinky straight yakky straight hair now when i say kinky straight yakky straight it's because once i went ahead and hot combed it flat ironed it it gave me like this kind of like yakky texture which is good because i love a yakky texture now as y'all see i'm just showing you what i had to do to it you know i curled it i pressed it i did all that thing to finesse it okay honeys now listen here now i'm gonna show you right on the right side I do believe I'm going to just go in a slow motion because I want you to see how I'm twirling that hair around the barrel. Girl, get into it. You nice. $127.99. Where you getting that from? I'm saying Amazon Prime, girl. Get your stuff on time. Or at least get you a wig on time, boo-boo. Okay. Now, next step. Y'all know I couldn't come through without doing a little bit of makeup, a razzle-dazzle to the face. Y'all seen how I kind of looked in the beginning. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to refresh my face up with some of this lavender spray. Okay, rub it all in. Bath and Body Works, I got that from. You know, when Bath and Body Works has a good annual sale, girl, I racks up. So I probably got like 20 of those bottles from a couple of years ago. And this tool of stuff that's supposed to brighten your under eye, that stuff works really good too, as y'all see. I don't really try to put a whole lot of makeup on. But that's, you know, it is what it is. Now, to moisturize my face, I'm going to use that Laura Mercier. It is a facial primer. And then I decided, girl, you best to stay down under that little peach fuzz. You got a little mustache going there. You might want to hook it up. So that's what I did. I hooked it up with my little straight razor. You know, get all in there. And then I'm going to just exfoliate it real quick. One of these right here, which I do like exfoliating swipey. Swipe it, all right? And then I'm going to just put a little bit more of that Mercier just to moisturize it. Because, honey, child, listen. And that right there is the Amazing Cosmetics, which is also a facial primer. That is for those who are older, like myself. Now, yes, boo, I am going to actually take that Gatsby gel 
and I'm going to put it on my brows. Because, honey, listen, I don't know about you, but I'm not about to spend $26 on no Anastasia freeze brow. Not happening. But I could just use what I got, and it's been working quite fancy and quite fine. Now, as you guys see, I'm going to fill these brows in with my NYX um, brow lip pen. And, girl, we're going to get into it, okay? There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas. Taking over the world. Keep us. Keep us. Let me tell you now, D. I. B. A. S. D. B. A. Y'all already know, this is the fun part of it all. This is where we about to razzle and dazzle everybody, okay? We gonna do it like it's our B-Day. We gonna do it like it's a holiday. We gonna do it like it's the new year. Girl, we gonna put our foot into this and we gonna look extra, extra cute, okay? Now, first of all, Unice has some really affordable wigs. I'm telling you guys, I've worked with them about two handfuls of times. I work with them enough, girl, okay? And I will say they got some really nice wigs. And if you love Amazon, Amazon Prime, get your shit on time, then girl, check them out, check them out. Because I don't know about you ladies or you gentlemen, but I love Amazon Prime, okay? So right here is the fun part. You know, you want to make sure that wig sticks. So I just sprayed on one or two or three coats of my favorite hairspray, which is the Aussie Instant Freeze. But the trick to this is you got to make sure that each layer gets tacky prior to spraying another layer on. You know how I'm feeling right there. Now this hairspray dries super duper quick. So if you want a good affordable hairspray, get you some Aussie Instant Freeze. They got it at Wally Worlds. They got it at Target's. Boo, they probably got it at your local grocery store. But all I'm telling you to do is check out the Aussie Instant Freeze and tell me how you like it. I use it to apply my wigs as well as I use it to style my wigs, to profile, to slay, to finesse. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> to razzle and dazzle them, okay? Razzle, dazzle, baby. Razzle, dazzle, drippity, drip, drop, okay? Now, this wig right here is super affordable. It's $127.99 on Amazon. That is $127.99. I'm saying 150% density, 18 inches. Girl, this 13 by 4 is definitely kicking. Now, I noticed in this unit that the, the roots are a little bit bright. I'm not really too concerned too much about that. I can't remember if it was me that did that. I don't think so. Because I did bleach the unit. I'm going to have to go back and look at how it looked on the mannequin prior to me doing anything. But girl, listen, let me tell you something. I am not concerned about that little bright orangish color. That gives me, um, what do you call it? It just gives me a little bit of difference, okay, from everybody else, all right? Personality. It's the personality. Now, right here is where, you know, just to conceal some of those edges a little bit, I'm going to just swoop a little baby hairs, and it ain't really about the edges too much. It's about my long-ass head, okay? So I just try to hide it as best as possible. Now, you know, put you on an elastic band or whatever you're going to tie around just to make sure your edges is right. And, girl, this hair is kinky. This was kinky hair when I first started. And once I pressed it, it became yakky texture. I, either way, I'm loving it. I love it. Now, just to perfect those knots, boo, girl, get you a camouflage concealer stick or what have you. This one I actually got from the Dollar Tree. That's the Ardell brand, and it works amazing. I've seen quite a few different products of Ardell at the Dollar Tree. So, honey, when I tell you, get you some, get you some. And for any little spillage of the concealer, I just take a wipe and I just remove it. Just wipe it off. And that's about it. And then go back to working.
Now, for the most part, I really don't have no issues with this unit. Yeah, the roots might be a little bit brighter in color. Girl, I don't care about that. I still think the wig looks nice, all right? I see that color throughout the unit, so that could be like a highlight. And I dare somebody to say something to me about it in person, okay, and see what you get in return. Okay, you might get a side eye, you might get a selfie picture with me, you might just get me look at you, laugh, and walk off. But either way, I'm not really too concerned about that brightish auburn color in the front because this wig is still cute. I like the way that I hooked it up, I like the way that it held a nice curl pattern, I like the texture, and baby, who don't like the price? So, this is what I'm talking about when you could work with a wig, get you an affordable wig, and try to hook it up because anything is hook upable. Is that even a word? I don't know, but we're going to use it as a word today. Okay. guys so i really was going to do an entire voiceover but i said you know what let me just put a little voice on this and let y'all know exactly what i was feeling when i got the wig so this is actually probably like the 10th I'm not, I might be exaggerating, but I've worked with Unice or Unice Hair several times in the past, past few years, and they are a very cheaper, a more affordable lace wig website. So if you want a budget girl, you can definitely get your share of a wig off of their website. However, they do some, some of the wigs you do need to customize to your liking with the lace and the bleaching of the knots and so forth, elastic band, all that good stuff. No, no. So if you are very familiar with those strategic measures, then girl, go for it. They have good hair. It'll last as long as you take care of it. Okay. That's first and foremost. Second of all, I've never, I can't remember if I've ever done a color with them, but this color is so rich. It's a very pretty color girl look. Okay. This is definitely a beautiful color and I'm not one to wear colors during certain seasons because look, if it look good on you, wear it, rock it. I don't care if it's winter, spring, summer, fall, girl, wear that shit, okay? Just wear it. But I do like this color. It's very rich and auburn-like. It, it reminds me of like a gingerish kind of auburn and not too ginger, not too auburn, kind of like a mixture in between. This is what I'm This is what I'm getting from this. The texture, I'm going to call this khaki, okay? This is khaki texture hair. Y'all probably like, girl, what? Khaki texture hair? Like, it's kinky. And then when you flat iron it, it gets to be a yakky texture. Girl, it's khaki okay khaki it's a new one it's a new one but it still held its texture it's not bone straight i like the fact that it did get straight through one pass through and it looked really cute um straight too girl like it did really look cute straight but i felt like you know what let me just try this out we're gonna see how a curl look up in this bad boy and girl do it like it's your b-day baby do it like you've grown a sex day this this is a pretty color i like it it's very neutral um the lace is you gotta work with it honey you got to work with it okay get into the spirit of working with the lace sweetheart tis the season to work in with the lace so this is a more workable in lace meaning it ain't going to disappear as soon as you hold it up against your skin you're going to have to work with it work with it you might need to do a little makeup with it the only reason why i had to do that is because the knots would not bleach because the hair was already colored but i did try to bleach it and it did lighten it a little bit now when i say work with the lace meaning you're going to have to know the tricks in the trade of learning how to slay okay bars for days so what i'm saying is don't put heat when you are drying or adhesive or adhering this wig, meaning don't sit up there blow drying once you put the hairspray on this because it's going to turn the lace like a white color. Try to allow your hairspray or your glue to get as tacky as possible. I think like this is the type of wig where you need hairspray because some wigs you can't do glue because of the, the, the lace. So with this one, allow at least three coats of hairspray, allow it to get tacky and then press into the lace. If you need to add a little bit more hairspray, I would say gently, lightly, either spray it on the tip of your comb or lightly on the unit and use your tail end of the comb to massage it in, which will allow the hairspray to distribute evenly and dry quickly. It also will allow the lace to disappear. Baby, do it like it's your B-Day 101, okay, with your girl A, all right? So on that note, I'm going to leave all the information down below for this unit on Eunice, you nice hair. Let me know what y'all think. This is a gorgeous color. Not too crazy about the, the tinted roots, but girl, listen, you can hook it up because this is one of those wigs where, look, 
if you got to pay, then you definitely going to slay, meaning you're not going to waste your coins. You're going to make sure this week look good, girl, when you step outside into the world. Period. So I love you all. Happy holidays. Make sure you stay diva and divolicious. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Do it like it show be day. Do it like it show be day, baby. Do it, girl. Do it in this wig.